right, let's get this going. All right, we are back here with our uh, friendly little British robotic cleaner horse. Still trying to clean stuff. Yeah, right, we survived the robot wars. Or where am I going? I don't remember what I was doing. Crap. I made my way into the town. Am I supposed to go somewhere? Oh, wait. I'm going completely the wrong way. I think I'm supposed to go back to the mansion. Yeah, if I remember correctly. I needed to use the passport machine to open the huge door. I made my way back out to the main land. Why oh, could they split the audio track? No. Uh, the... Like, the cutscenes... Play on my headphones. But every... All the other audio plays on my TV. Really, there's nothing I can do about that. I even have it set for. Oh, I've done that. I even have it set for. On a. I the fisherman's boat. The old man's sister. In the default settings, I even have it set so that uh, the game plays on the headphones. The evil butler. Audio playing? Okay.
Okay. It's just not showing up on my end that it actually is. No. Showing up on my end that it actually is. No. No, you're not allowed to die. If I actually do that... Okay, yeah, no. Audio is glitching. And that one just in case. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. Say that. Okay. Yeah, no, yeah, it looks like audio is not coming through the headphones. Why not?
You know what? That's fine. The dog and the dog is laughed at us. Actually. I wonder. Let's click that. Let's see if that does it. They really wanted to say that. No, okay. Uh. Hmm. I would be the secret weapon as I would be able to sneak back into oh. the house. That's true, said Sim, if we cause enough of a distraction. As long as you can get up to the roof, we'll be able to take control of the satellite. Hopefully the virus hasn't reached all the other robots around the world. Suddenly, all her ah. broke loose. The old lady, Alex and the others opened fire. This was just the distraction I needed to make my way up to the roof. Go oh, people! shocked. However, this time not just by the giant brain, but rather what the man in black had done to him. I do not want to, said Mr. Deck, but I will shoot you if I must. Will you? Why don't you give up, said the man in black. Why don't you give up? Which side was right. Why don't you join us? I know we've had our differences, but I see potential in you. No. You could be my new right hand man. You see, there's a link between you and I. Without me you wouldn't even be here. The two brothers designed and built you. But what nobody ever told you is, they were funded by their third brother. Me. I was speechless. What a twist! How could he, this completely evil man, have something to do with my creation? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. No. A minor setback, said the man in black as he disconnected a piece of the satellite hardware. I just need to take this core unit and hitch it up to one of the killbots. In fact, that will make the virus signal even stronger. Well, it Mr. Why? Deck, said the man in black, would you be so kind as to watch the robot? Shoot him if he tries anything. Mr. Deck lowered his gun. You little Hi, monster. yellow bastard, he said. You'd better run. Better run? Yeah. What the hell have I gotten into? Under the roof. Okay. 
At least I'm under it. Um... Wrong way, I guess. Of course, no shields. Mm -hmm. Ow! Motherfucker. Seriously? I to crouch for walk. And Hate those electrical fields. Motherfucker. There we go. Motherfucker. Shouldn't have rushed it. God damn it. Yes, give me that. Okay, there's no junk in here. Whoa. 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 Whee. Motherfucker. All right, there you go. God damn it. Should not be that hard. Fuck off. Keep going. Ow.
On. There you go. Ooh. Okay. Breathe. Oh, oh, that fire's moving. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and... Yeah, I gotcha. Over here. No, oh, no, I gotta do this side now. Is that how this works? Yep. <laughs> Just keep dying. Over here. Seriously? Okay, so it's not moving down. Ah, I got gotcha. you. Really? Where's my shield? I've died so many times.
Okay. What do I do about the fire then? Oh, I think I see. Hmm. God damn it. I have no clue what to do. Oh, so it's pretty much just avoiding. Gotcha. That was stupid. Really? Okay, so I can't even touch the red. Gotcha. All right. Robot battle. So X and A. X A X A X A. Okay. Gotcha. <laughs> Evil horse. Robots battle. Shot shot. Uh. 
Ow, motherfucker. Seriously? Boom! God damn it. Like, why can't I fucking counter? Hey. Like, I just can't get a fucking hit on him. When he goes into that whole combo mode.
Let's see? Just can't fucking get the combo. There we go. How can Yeah, no, you caused too much pain. Fuck you. Somehow the man in grey had snuck up behind Mrs. Silton. I tried to shout down, but no one could hear me. Hit him, dog! Uh, hey! Oi, shouted a familiar voice. Step away from my wife. The man Ooh. in grey bragged with every blow. Who he'd hurt. Who he tortured. How he'd made the world a better place. As he raised the gun to Mr. Silton's head, he said, You're out of your depth. I'm a professional. I used the kill for the CIA. Mr. Silton just smiled and said, Yeah. And I'm a proper c- Oh, cigarette to the eye. Get him, doggy. Get him. Yeah. It's milk. Mr. Silton in the yard with the lead pipe. Um. That's enough. That's enough. Mr. Silton? With the rest of the great and good now stuck on the moon and the man in black taken care of, it was reasonably easy to convince his troops to surrender. Signals came through from all over the planet and soon the people began rebuilding civilization. Where's Japan? And again, I was heralded as a hero. Soon the representatives from around the world held their first united meeting and I was invited to give a speech. Okay. Oh. So nervous he shut down. The old lady gently examined me while Sim attached a cable from the diagnostic machine. I've got some bad news, uh -oh. said the old lady as she took my hand. The virus is rampant in your system. It's not as bad as it was with Betty Fluffers and Fort, but it's still destroying your circuitry. I'm thinking, said Sim, it must have something to do with consciousness. Yours seems more equipped to fight. We'll oh, still fuck. need to After do all the things I've been through, yeah. Old lady with a serious look. If we replace all of the affected parts, we... Come on, mate, said Mr. Silton. You know they can help. But I explained that it was too painful and hurt so much. 
Just having my diagnostic panel open was excruciating. I feel so pain. You, you can feel things. But, you're not supposed to be able to. I'm not supposed to be able to do a lot of things. The virus hasn't completely taken over, Sim explained. But I don't know how long you've got, maybe months, maybe years. <laughs> when you, well. If it all gets a bit too much, said the old lady, come back here and we'll look after you. You should try to get everything done that you want to before then though, said Sim. You know, maybe complete your quest, get your million things, play some games, I mean just do all the things, bucket list mate. Interrupted Mr. Silton, go paint the town red. Remember, said Alice, should you need us? Yes, should you need us, said Mr. Logan, we'll be right here, said the old lady, waiting Aww, it's for a you. warm fuzzy moment. RPDM. That'll do, robot. That will do. Oh. Hmm. Yeah. Whoa. Ah. Anything in here? Yeah, 176. And I believe it was all the robots here. Nope, still 176. Okay. I don't know what that one does. Damn. Oh, that worked. Oh, junk here too. Junk held to zero. Okay. There's two pieces of junk that I haven't got from here. I wonder where. Hmm. 
No. Ah. There we go. Junk here, 80. Wonder where. You dirty old man. Yeah, I wonder where the rest of that is. But you know what? Anything in here? Ninja suit. I'm invisible for a short time. Activate by pressing down, down, run. Ninja robot. Aw. Oh. Uh, give me one second here. Okay. Hmm. 
Amen. Okay, that is cool. Um, but really, that is the end of the game there. Hmm. You have saved the world. Is your work here done? Yeah. Over the next couple of months, I started to get slower and slower. I needed a cane to help me walk, and my circuits felt so cold that the old lady suggested I wore the old man's lovely thick jacket. Life was simple. One day into the next. Just helping out wherever I could. Then one morning things got really exciting. Mrs. Silton was going to have the baby. Eventually, after much screaming and cursing, mostly from Mr. Silton, the baby was born. He was this lovely little squishy pink thing, but for some reason he wouldn't stop crying. Ali suggested getting him a teddy bear, but there was no way Heather was giving hers away, that's when I remembered something. Where am I going? That's perfect, said the old lady. Thank you. Hey kid, shut up. Aww. Even his hat split in half. Moment of peace for the fallen bot. One last dream, I guess. No junk here? Okay. The old man and the young daughter. Yeah, it came pretty close to a million.
fault. That's Horus. As long as it was, that was a really good game. Like, Paul Hellman, beautiful writing. I, I, I give him props for this. And the throwbacks to so many old games and references like Charlie Brown right there for Happy Halloween. I mean, the robot battles and and Breakout and all, all those games from like the, from Atari to new generation. I mean, it was beautifully put together. And I hope that this team continues on. Like Paul Heyman, he's done the design, he's done the music. This, this, this game surprised me on how well crafted it was. Um, like, the difficulty level was a lot like the old games of Nintendo and Super Nintendo and Sega Genesis. And you tend to forget on how hard those games can be over time compared with games now. See, like, look at that. Like, a genuine thank you from Paul Hellman. Like, you don't see a whole lot of that in games. Like, he's put a lot into this. His entire team has. And it was bloody brilliant. And I hope he does more. I mean... You know what? Let, let's, let's take a look on Steam, just quickly. I will just move over there. Um, yeah, let's see. Steam store page. Like developers. It's not even a, a company. It's just... Paul Hellman and Sean, Sean someone. Let's see what. Story rich adventure bundle. What is this? All three games he's done. Horrors I have. Then there's Eternal Hope and The Wild at Heart. I mean, let's. See, what's eternal hope? Oh, it's not showing. Go kit. Um, there. Let's do it. Okay, so eternal hope is a puzzle platformer game that follows the story. Of Tibby, a boy who must embark on a journey of love and hope to find his beloved soul. Okay. Like the the graphic style.
Okay, that is uh Okay, double shift games. Or double shift. Um so yeah, add to my wish list. Or maybe well Hellman it's there just because Horus is part of it. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Um, well, considering Horse came out 2019, I I really hope he continues. I hope he gets hired at a game company that that sees um, the potential in him. Like his friend there, Sean. Let's see. The artifact. Uh, woken from a hypersleep, you find yourself alone on a drilling star cruiser, light years from home. Who's missing? Leaving behind nothing but a few scattered records. A strange artifact that seems to hold the key to alien civilization. Come on, you can load. There you go. This would be kind of interesting. No, yeah, no, that is definitely... That was definitely interesting. Okay. I'll put that on my wish list. Um Fuck, it's only been an hour. Wasn't expecting to finish horse this quickly. Mm. What to do, what to do. Oh. Uh, do I have anything for the next two hours? What? Let's do this one. Actually, no. E simulator. I'll do this in later. Yeah, let's do Beast Simulator. Um, can I use the controller for this, or is it? Come close. No. Okay. We shall become bees. Okay.
In that case... I'm gonna end the stream, set it up for a B simulator.